A film crew has taken over a gym at Rochester Institute of Technology. It's shooting a film based on a deaf former RIT wrestling champ who's now a mixed martial arts contender. YNN Seth Voorhees has more on why Matt Hamill's story inspired a pair of LA producers. They call him the hammer. Right now I'm under the weight on. Matt Hamill says he likes being the underdog. I have a lot of uh, tools on the table, but it's still under the sleeve. The rising mixed martial arts fighter's story is now being told by Hollywood. The filming is being done right here in Rochester, much of it in a gym that's familiar to Hamill. Um, they have just got a memory because they did 300 dead people right now. Yeah, it's the first time they saw me all. Oh, who's Matt Hamill? Matt Hamill graduated from RIT in 1999 with a degree in electromechanical technology. He starred on the wrestling mat, a three-time NCAA Division III champion. It's impressive for anyone, inspirational, because Matt is deaf. It's been a great experience. Joseph McAleer says fellow writer and producer Evan Kostbar pitched the idea to him after seeing Hamill on an ultimate fighting reality show. People can identify with it because everyone has a goal. You know, everyone has something they want to attain to, and everyone, every goal everyone has, there's also obstacles within that, no matter what you want to do, no matter who you are, no matter what your limitations are. And that happened to come up to me, I want to Movie about you. That, that's what happened if you come to that film. The writers saw an inspirational tale of struggle and success. They were also intrigued by something else. That was the first time we were introduced to the deaf community and deaf culture, and we're blown away by the people and the, and the culture itself. Many on the crew and some of the actors, including the lead, are deaf. Hamill hopes his story can inspire others. Most deaf people are just stuck in the circle and they don't want to do anything, you know, the whole, they're, they're better than me, they're better than me, I can't do it, I can't do it, no, 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 no. Hamill now lives in the Utica area. He's actually training for his next MMA fight, which is scheduled for December. I just want to be the best fighter in the world. I'm trying to go for, for the title. Hamill says being deaf inside the octagon does have its advantages. He can't hear the crowds and doesn't get nervous. The filming at RIT will continue through mid-October. Post-production should be done by spring. I think this story is just its to remind people that, you know, if you set your mind to something, you can do it, regardless of, you know, what your limitations might be. Seth Voorhees, YNN.